How's it going, everybody? Welcome back, and let's talk about how to use the Tailwind CSS Typography plugin. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to paste in an article, and it's not looking that great, it's just kind of, you know, bare bones, HTML, absolutely no styling, and that's where the Typography plugin is really going to shine. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm just going to install the plugin, and as you can see, this is gonna be the command. All right, so this is already installed, which is great, and I'm gonna go over to the Tailwind config, okay? Now, normally we're gonna have a plugin section here, but if it's not there, just go ahead and type that, and that property is going to be an array. And so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna type in require, and great autocomplete. That's exactly what I want here at Tailwind CSS slash typography. Perfect. Let me go ahead and save this. Okay. So we're good to go. And what I'm going to do here is I am going to add a couple classes. This is how we get that typography plugin working. So I'm going to make a class attribute and I'm going to type pros XL pros dash XL. Okay. And once I save that, you're already seeing all of these styles applied. This looks way better. And this is just right out of the box with these two classes that I just added. So hopefully this can really help you out when, you know, rendering um, some HTML that's unstyled and you just want to get this content up and running, styled nicely uh, out of the box. Uh, the, the Tailwind Typography plugin can definitely help you out. So I hope this video helped. If it did, go ahead and give us a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one.